G'day guys, I'm Captain Deadmeat and welcome to a brand new playthrough. Today we're going to be checking out a game called Oxenfree. But before we do that, why not hit the like button, don't forget to subscribe because I release that brand new content every single day. Well, good morning. I hope you are having a wonderful morning of if it is in fact morning for you. It is for me, it is a bright sunny day outside, but I'm inside playing games with you guys because that's more fun. So, today we're going to be checking out a game called Oxenfree. It is a supernatural mystery game. Uh, the game came out around 2016, I want to say. It is uh, more of an indie title game. Apart from that, I don't really know a lot about it, but I want to give this game a go, because it could be a bit of fun. Uh, apparently, it's a very short game, so there won't be a lot of playthrough of this. Uh, I believe it is somewhere around the four to five hour mark, but we're just going to jump in, in and have some fun with it. So let's get started with some oxen free. It used to be a military base. It used well, to be a military base. It used to be a ranching thing, then it was turned into an army thing, then it became a bird thing and a museum or whatever. What are we talking Henry about here? Henry Fonda stationed here, I think, for a bit. Unless he was Navy. Who's Henry Fonda? Around Christmas time, this little breakfast place used to sell these amazing polar bear sugar cookies. Man, those were good. And then one year they changed the formula or whatever and ruined it. Dude, this dude talks a lot. All right. Alex? Hey. Still with us? Yo. You haven't said anything for like 10 minutes. Uh I'm I listening. Watch the hypnotic rolling of the waves and listen to you at the same time. Oh, okay. What did I say? Little miss, I can see and hear things at the same time. <laughs> I think you said something something, something cookies. cookies or whatever. <laughs> Perfect. You're right on the money. Yeah. <laughs> okay, so it's 8 p.m. So you all moved in? Um not not really. Okay. I just got in this morning. And how did her mom meet your dad exactly? Ah. <laughs> uh. Vacation in Orlando. He got lost in a. You know, actually, I'm not even gonna tell this story. It's really not worth it. <laughs> okay. Uh, yes. Please don't. Let's not relive their meet cute any more than we have to. <laughs> right. Gotcha. And you guys just met tonight? Yeah, I was um. I'd been out of school, and the timing had just never worked out, so... And what does that make you to her, then? Hey, uh, Step brothers! Step brother! Oh, yeah. I forgot that was even a thing. Oh, yeah, well, step brother. Well, cool, right? Cool guy, cool hat. You get a cool new sibling living right in your house. Sharing your toothbrush. Wearing your clothes. Eating your food. Yeah, it's yeah, nice. No, it's a nice perk, I guess. Unless you're like a pyro or something. Just a klepto, so you're in luck. <laughs> right, so he just steals all your stuff. So. Oh, I can do actually move. Know each other. Oh, from way back when, like Paleozoic, grade school era. Young enough that I've seen her in a bathtub and it wasn't sexual at all. I mean, we both looked like little skinned potato blobs. <laughs> and to date, that's still what I think she looks like under her clothes. Right. Okay, so you cannot. Check under your seat to make sure you don't leave behind any grandchildren. Right. And if you picked up a complimentary disposable radio, uh, so how do you it's a recording. Know it? They always play. Oh, oh, we should get a quick picture. All of us. Hang on, I'm at the water fountain. Let's, like the before shot. Yeah, on let's do it. Hang on, I'm, good. I'm coming, I'm coming. Not Jonah? Yeah, Jonas. Jonas. Like gotcha. Jonas Salk. Right, patient zero, AIDS guy. Um, polio. Here's good. Yes, I'm moving, I'm moving, I'm moving, I'm moving. Come Hang on, on I'm coming, I'm coming, I'm coming. Post for the picture. What do we reckon? Alright, so this Ren dude talks there, a hell of a lot. Great. I'll magic erase all the words out and stuff, so don't worry. How am hey, I... Alex, you brought the radio, right? Oh the my god. One? You talk too much! Yeah, of course. Perfect. Can you pull it out a second? Uh... There's the little guy. Right. High school has a radio station, and Carly, she's a friend of ours. She's filling in because Reggie got mono from some track runner or something. It doesn't matter. What matters is that she's going to say something like, basically, right now, about our thing. So, tune it to 88.3 so I can tell her we heard it. 88.3. Hang on, i got to get to 88.3. It's a... Hey, there we go. That's right. But anyways, I promised him that I'd play a song from his band. So, hope you're listening, Ren. Oh, we're listening. Here are the red-headed bedwetters with baby carrots. 
<laughs> Red-headed bedwetters. Right. I'm a baby carrot. I'm a baby <laughs> carrot. I hope Christina, with her talent show judge face, was listening. Okay. So, we got Ren, who talks must be getting close. a hell of a lot. There's no radio reception on the island. I'm glad I got to hear it before Jonas. Totally kaput. If we can't use it, why'd you bring it? Not just for the boat. Um, no. You'll see. I don't expect too much, but nah, it'll be fun. I won't undercook it. You'll see. Uh, who's she? Okay. There was a lot to take in all at once. But that's the gang. Apparently we're going to an island to have a party. And they're stepbrother and stepsister. And he's the best friend who's seen her naked and she looks like a potato. Did we get all that, ladies and gentlemen? That was a lot of information to take in all at once. But I kind of liked it. I like the art style. The art style is really nice. It's kind of a like a watercolor painting. Smell that clean air, boys and girls. Boy and girl. This ain't city living. Yeah. Edwards Island. Anybody need a smoke? I have a full pack. Uh, oh, uh, no thanks. I mean, I literally just said the clean air thing, so... Alex, you can bum one off right. me if you're empty. I forget if you're a fellow addict. Oh, you know what? She doesn't smoke either, so... <laughs> okay, just checking. All right, my other friend should be up and around the bed. Actually, that... I mean, I don't mean to be the guy to break us up already, but Ren, can you do me a favor? Yo. I have like two real quick minutes with Alex for a second. And okay. You can, you know, you can run up and meet your friends. Uh, really? Just wait. Is is something wrong? What is it? Nothing's wrong. Nothing's yeah, what's wrong. wrong? It'll just take two minutes, super fast. Yeah, we're just gonna right, have a quickie but, in the back room because we're step brother and step sister. Go wink, wink, myself. nudge, nudge. I mean, can't we just stick together? You're gonna have all night to say like whatever. But since you want to meet up with your friends anyway, we're all gonna meet up with them. No, it's. It's fine, Ren. Yeah, let me hear him. Hear him out. That's fine. Don't worry about it. Um, okay. I guess. Off you go. Well, this is a really strange way to start off. So Shut up, Ren. You piss fast. off and go and do Thanks, your own man. thing. Wow. I'll just be up the hill in case. That's right. Whatever. Off you go. Ren seems nice. He talks a hell of a lot. You know? Reminds me of a guy I know back home. Yeah, he's... <sighs> Look, just what did you want to talk to me about before I suspect something nefarious? No, it's nothing. It's not bad. Listen, I just wanted to grab you ahead of time and say you've been cool about everything. And I guess it's just for me, I, I, I've never moved anywhere. And like getting a new family... Dude, are you hitting on your stepsister? Kind of feels like I think you might be. Training wheels. Not that it's been bad or anything. You and your mom have been great. Uh, we'll make do. Lemons. Lemonade. Lemonade. However that goes. <laughs> he is an a optimist. Blood. Oh, Christ. Ah, oh, come on, Jonas. <laughs> yeah, I'm an optimist. Yeah. I'm proud of it. Oh, and thanks for setting up the attic for me. It's Come cool on. how it's like a little bedroom. Yeah, no problem. Come on, Jonas, move your butt. Let's go. There's parties to be had. I heard you were in jail. Um, I think from my mom that you uh went to jail. Yeah. Yeah. Well. Don't believe everything you hear. Why not? We can. Is it true? Catch back up with Ren now. I didn't mean to take so long. Ah, uh, you just don't want to talk about the fact you were in jail. What were you in jail for, huh? Huh? Who did you kill? Who did you kill? Uh, oh, what's this? Off road. Uh, I think they blocked this off at night since nobody needs to use it, or maybe they just had a parade. Okay. Sure. Either one. Uh. Can we steal a car? Did did you go to jail for stealing a car? I think you went to jail for stealing a car, didn't you? Let's steal his car. Uh, if nobody lives here and the stores are all closed, whose car is this? Oh, there's always that one lonely car in every parking lot. Maybe ride. it belongs to the mass murderer who's gonna hunt us down and kill us. Oh, hang on, no, it's a supernatural mystery, not a horror. Hmm. Maybe it belongs to the aliens. It's a statue. Ah, oh, I forgot this was even here. It's a monument to some submarine that was sunk off the coast. Oh, do the the um, the radio guide thing they talked about on the boat, you know? It's what, what, 102.3? I just want to see how it works. What is it, 102? 102. Named after the Hawaiian god of the sea. All right. The USS Kanaloa was launched on January 15th, 1941, and commissioned into service at the end of that year under the command of Lieutenant James Earl Clapman. Clapman! On October 28th, 1943, it was sunk by the Japanese sub-chaser Tokusada, 
some 25 miles off the coast of Washington, and remains, to this day, the only submarine casualty in American waters. 85 officers, as well as 12 Army passengers, were lost. The propeller was recovered in 1962, and in 1965 erected as a monument to the heroism of the brave men and women who tragically perished. Right. After the Hawaiian god of the you sea, quiet. The US oh, apparently I have no land connection. Why do I have no land connection? Uh, maybe my internet just went out. Doesn't matter, it's not important. I'm stuck. Alright, so maybe we're going to end up with a problem with the dead people coming back from the facilities office. Uh, submarine. Sister Allison used to work there. You'd like her. She's tall. Um, alright. Okay. Can't go in there. Alright. And then this is an antique store. Yeah, they close up early. I guess no point in staying open if nobody's here. True. That's true. Hello, kids. Look, the other guys and gals must be. Hey, Rin. Run, so be quick now. Okay, speed read definition of Edwards Island. This is a tourist trap with shops and a beach. Nobody lives here except for some geriatric named Mrs. Adler. Gotcha. But as God is my witness, we'll never mention her or any other old person's name again. We are here to drink and be stupid. A tradition apparently started by bored recruits in the 1950s who would sneak dates over from the coastal towns. They literally called it trolling. Uh huh. The beaten path officially ends here. The beach is past the fence. I think Jerry told me that there's a way that you used to get over there, but I'm blanking on what it was. But it's not, I mean, it can't be too difficult. So to summarize, we are not allowed here after dark. Gotcha. The town is shut down and we, the Kamina High junior class, have come to commit improper acts. And the other thing is the weirdo caves. What weirdo, weirdo caves? caves? The whole reason Alex brought her radio is because when you go to the, it's like the front. The mouth. The mouth of this particular cave, you can sometimes pick up frequencies to stations that don't exist. You'll hear voices or just sound. It's, um, it's pretty creepy. Yeah. At least I've heard. That sounds it creepy. Once. It's amazing when it works. So back up a second. Who's Mrs. Adler? Her family, I think, like, owns or owned some of the island or something. Right. She's been shacked in the same spot for like 70 years. She's kind of what you call the local legend. She has a house on the other side of the woods. Man. That woman won the life lottery. Seven uh, years what are we doing? We're pushing. With the I think the dumpster will get us over if it'll budge. Where are we uh, going? Let's try it. Get us over with. Be okay with never leaving. Really? Yeah. Why wouldn't I be? Yeah, I'd like to stand this alone. Why would you move? Yeah. Why would you, Jonas? Did you know that a little birdie told me that our Alex here is thinking of going out of state to college? Oh, really? Yeah. Nothing wrong with going to college out of state. Sounds like a great idea. Meet new people, new places, wonderful, exciting adventures. I like the idea. 9 p.m. All right. Oh, uh, before we get there, I should, I should probably mention that. <laughs> oh, God. oh, God. Who's that? That's, so, there's this girl. Nona. Nona. She's just this girl, and I'm totally into her, and I want her to be into me. So just, you know, j just be cool, okay? No pouting or complaining or anything, all right? Deal? Ren, relax. Yeah, come on, Ren, just relax, dude. Okay, Chill okay. the fuck out. Jonas, now that we're dumpster buddies, what was the thing that you said to Alex back there? Do you have one of those vestigial tales or something? Uh, it was nothing. Just leave it alone, Ren. Ren yeah, no. Ren, you're a nosy you bastard. There. Hey, guys. Wait, I was saying. I was about to tell a story. What was hey, it? Hey, Clarissa. About Brad's car. Oh, well, that can wait. Come on. Hey, we started a fire down the way, but Nona wanted to play beach nanny, so... Uh, yeah. Everyone, this is Jonas. Hi, guys. Jonas? What's happening? Everyone. This hey. is my stepbrother. Hi. And Jonas, that's... Who are you again? Jonas. Jonas. He's Alex's new in town, fresh as the daisy stepbrother. Aw, uh, yeah. Stepbrother? Really? Yeah, I know. It's a trip, right? Uh, yeah, he's a cool guy from cool North Valley, so let's all try and show him a good time. <laughs> yeah, come on. Be nice to him. <laughs> Just the beach and some beer will be enough, I'm sure. Wait, 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 wait. You're Jonas. Jonas, the stepbrother. Yeah. Yeah, um, we just said that. What's your name dumbass. again? That is Clarissa. How but are she's... your stepbrother? Like, what does that even mean? 
Um, my mom married his dad, so family law. Yeah, all. come on. Do you yeah, not know what a stepbrother is? is? Now, this is a thing that is happening, so... <sighs> Where is everyone else? Nicole had that tennis thing. And? Clarissa, we... <laughs> We took the last ferry. I thought more would show up. Clarissa's an oh God, idiot. It's just Alex and her new stepbrother? Huh, that's it. That's who you brought. That's the group. Ugh, come on, Clarissa. I'm fun. I'm hip. I'm with it. Listen to yourself. Wait, aren't you all, like, friends? I'm friends with Nona, and I'm downgrading Ren to, like, a creepy neighbor. And you, I just met. <laughs> hey, yeah. what about me? Yeah, what about what me? about you? Ooh, Clarissa's a bitch. Oh, hey, this is my map. Ah, uh, so that's the ferry, and then there's the Discovery Caves. Beacon Beach, Adler Estates. Wow, there's a bit going on here. Uh, alright. Let's put that away. Where are we going? Uh, let's go... Go to the beach! All right, it's beach time. We have a party. Where are the beers? Fire. Man's great equalizer. So, what's the um, what's the like thing to do here? Drink beer. Other than obviously go skinny dipping and get murdered by Jason Kruger. Yeah, let's just get drunk. Jason Kruger, it's Freddy Kruger, you moron. Right? Hey, where does that old woman live? Oh, you mean Maggie Adler? Yeah. Nowhere. She's dead. What? Yep, killed over three days ago. It was all over the news. Local news, anyway. Oldest living resident. Bummer. Oh, that's sort of a bummer. Yeah, well, we all gotta go sometime. And her yeah, I hope you die it. soon, Clarissa. Your previous question, Jonas, the thing to do is lay on the beach and drink till you can't remember where you are. Oh, I want to push her in the fire. And sometimes <laughs> play truth or slap. Yeah, truth or let's slap. Play that. We can inaugurate Jonas. Ease him into the night's festivities. Isn't it truth or Isn't dare? It, uh, truth or dare? This is better than truth or dare because nobody ends up licking somebody's butthole. You get asked a question. You have to tell the truth. But if somebody can prove that you lied, the accuser gets to slap you. Gotcha. It's a good, uh, getting to know somebody game. Fun. Yeah, fun. An excuse to hit run. <laughs> hey, I'm the truthiest truth. Whoever All truth, right, let's uh, just get on with it. Let's okay. do it. So, first, we're going to... I'll gonna... start. Ren. Uh-huh. Come on, fess up. You want to go out with Nona, right? Yay! Carissa. Wait, wait, wait. I want to hear... Oh, man. You're good at this. Well, if being good means being kind of mean about it. Look, it's tough to gauge. Uh, something mm -hmm. like... Enough stalling. I know you want to sample the goods. Now no. just say Ooh, something. Clarissa. I, I, I like her as a friend, right? That's... I just like her as a friend. Time that's, to slap. That's all. Time to slap. She's cool. Time she's, to slap. She's Let's just... ease off the throttle for the next one, okay, Clarissa? Clarissa's yeah. a bitch, man. What? This game isn't any fun if you don't get a stomach ache. Okay, it's Ren's turn, right? He gets to ask somebody something. Yeah, Alex, come on, Ren. Alex. <laughs> uh oh. Lay it on me. Oh please, shoot! I can take it. Okay, Mary, screw, kill. Me, Nona, and Clarissa. Why? Uh, <laughs> first I'd marry. And Jonas is family now. Uh. So he's excluded. Ren. Well, I think I'd marry you. Actually, we know each other the best, so not a lot of surprises there. Perfect. Stay at home husband. Yeah. <laughs> then okay, I would screw Nona. She seems like she'd be present and giving, unlike some people here. Hey, I'm present. I wouldn't lose my place or nothing. Oh, yeah, Scouts right. <laughs> oh, God, this is such a horrible turn. And then Clarissa, Which, she's of dead. Of course, means that you'd strangle Clarissa in her sleep if you ever got the No, chance. not in her sleep. I'd what kill her. <laughs> eh, she got what was coming to her. <laughs> yeah, I mean, you did shove her into the community pool in sixth grade. Yeah! <laughs> I did, didn't I? I was a hilarious kid. No, you were a bitch. And you still are. So, Alex's turn? Yep. Lady's choice. Alex gets to pick who to ask something of. Ooh, oh, who, right, are who are we picking? Who are we picking? Who are we picking? Uh, Jonas. Jonas. <laughs> yeah? Uh, well, like a ten. think about moving here? <laughs> Um, I like it, honestly, and people seem nice. I mean, Kamina's a crap load better than West Edge. Right. Is that where you're from? Yeah, it's less than great. What's what wrong with West you Edge? Like about your hometown? Well, everybody's a farmer or a banker, and nobody did well in anything anyway, so it didn't even matter. 
And besides, like we here. got the beach. Except for the farming and the banking. And I guess the third one, too. Is it my question now, then? Yep. Okay, Clarissa, um, last person you made out with. Oh, um, uh, maybe something else. Or, yeah, maybe... What's wrong? the last person you, uh, hugged and said? Uh, what's the matter? It's an honest question. Oh, will you all relax? I've made out with people since... God. Anyways, um, that would have to be Ryan Fisher, two weeks ago in Iggy's death. I knew it. Ooh. Yeah, well, he was there, and I was tired. So turn now. Clarissa is a bitch and a whole. A brother. Aha! Exciting. I'm sure Jonas is excited or maybe excited isn't the right word. Maybe a little overwhelmed with just everything, you know? Unsure. It's a lot to take in and adjust to. I'm um Is there like a question coming? <laughs> yeah, exactly. I'm just saying what Jonas is already thinking. That statistics show if you get divorced once, you're probably going to get divorced again. You're a bitch. And the fact is your mom divorced your dad. Bitch, so bitch, 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 bitch. Let's bitch. put his mind at ease and hear why. I, I okay, don't... just get to whatever point this is getting to. Yeah, come on, Clarissa. Point is, you suck. Why'd your parents get a divorce? Just so Jonas can hear it from you. Clarissa, I don't really care why they got a divorce. You know why. Michael died and it broke everything and yeah. they couldn't handle it. The end. Well, now you know, Jonas. Don't die and everything will be fine. Oh, okay, dude, I want to kill what? Clarissa. You know, guys, honestly, I think I'm pretty much ready to do anything else besides this game. Wait, let's let's not stop like this. We should... Like... Game's over, Ren. I won. And to celebrate, I'm going to sit on the beach and drink and maybe if I'm feeling spicy, even take a nap. Maybe we can... And get... that's exactly what Nona's going to do, too. Oh, Just... my God, you are annoying. <laughs> this is me being annoying. I'm this calling her out. Tired. I'm There's calling her out. Cheese. If you guys in your scavenger hunt or playing Ring Around the Rosie happen to find anything more interesting than a slowly dying starfish, you be sure to just let me know. God, I Super. hope she's the first one to die. <sighs> Whatever. Well, I want to inaugurate this bitch by checking out the caves. Yeah, let's go. No, no, want to come? Uh, I mean, I would. I'm very but... clingy, Ren. <sighs> Fine. Jonas, you're a strapping young lad. Help boost me over the fence. The cave's just, uh, yonder. And I guess you expect me to just jump over after? Yep. But like I said, you're a strapping young lad. Come on, let's go. I want to go see these caves. Okay, come on. Get away from Clarissa, because she's a bitch! Where are you from again? It's a small town near North Valley. Oh, yeah. Is it nice? If you like bars on the windows. I want to come too. I want to come too. I'd Alex, like... you want to check out the caves? Yes, or... yes, yes. Yeah, let's do it. Boost me up. Yeah. I don't want to stay Come around on. this bitch. That, and I'm hoping when I... Come on, I'll push you over. <laughs> when oh, I come back, oh, that Clarissa's oh dead. Never talked about John. Oh, what, their date? So, the cave. What's your bets? On a scale of 1 to 10, how weird's it going to be? Uh, 11. Hmm, probably a 5. Weird enough to remember, but... Not weird enough to tell anybody about it after. Yeah. Whoa, look at the cave. It's huge. <laughs> All right. Hey, Chris seems to be her normal annoying self. Sorry about that. Yeah, Ren. About Nona. Yeah, about what? Nona. Did she say anything? Because oh. if she said anything, you should tell me. Like, word for word. What do you like about her anyway? I, uh, I don't know. I just think, I just she's, think she's hot. hot. Cute. And, I don't know. I Fair think she's her. cool. That's cool. all. I just like her whole vibe. Good for Ren. Okay. Now, who's ready to have their minds blown? All right, let's go. Cool. Mean that literally. Me. Me, me, me. Oh wait, actually, I almost forgot. Gonna take a little magic trip to Cupcake Town. What? Those look like brownies. Brownie Town. No, never mind. Come on, Ren. The last thing I want is to have to chase your frail, screaming body into the ocean because you want to pet a fish or something. <laughs> Jonas is uh, good too. Ah, Ren's a starter. Right, Jonas. Mikomita, Sukomita? Uh, no thanks. I'm with her on the whole not flipping out and drowning myself thing. Okay. Drugs are bad, kids. Drugs are bad. Mm. But playing with mysterious Lovely. supernatural things is great! Okay, so these you should do it all the time. The kids before us always leave them here, so you know where to try and tune in the signals. So gotcha. you're going to want to stand basically right around here. And just tune the dial left or right until you start hearing some weirdness. All right, I'm coming, I'm coming, I'm coming, I'm coming. How will we know when it's... Bit of Morse code. Oh, what is that? Holy crap. 
Wow, it's even cooler than I thought it would be. What is it? What's doing it? Maybe the tuning's like unblocking a weather balloon or something? <laughs> it doesn't no. make any sense. Well, it's just crazy then, because I don't know. If you move around, it kind of changes too, I think. Like, over at this pile. Alright, let's try this one. And try it. Uh, let's go back the other way. This is so cool. <laughs> that I is know. creepy. Larissa and Nona should see this, right? I mean, I know it's like weird with you guys or whatever for some reason, but they they're fine where they are. Okay, just what is Clarissa's issue with you two? She dated Michael for five seconds like three years ago. It was for a couple of months a year and a half ago. Whatever, she never liked me. Not even then. I was oh, always the little sister who got in the way, who she had to climb in through windows to sneak around. Clarissa's the kind of person who doesn't feel full unless she's pissed at somebody. So. She's just a bitch. <laughs> she's just. Money's kicking in. Did that make sense? Yeah, it did to me. Okay, good. Now, there's another cool spot, I think, over here. Oh, it sounds I feel so. It. Yeah, it sounds. Uh. Creepy. Scary. It's freaking me out a little. Yeah. What, what the? That? No, no, don't, no, 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 yeah, I have this thing about crawling into strange, dark, wet places that exactly. cave in at any moment. It's not gonna. Come on, I can see it from here. It's not that far. We'll be in and out. <laughs> in and out. <laughs> Fortune favors the bold. <laughs> <laughs> Bye. Wait. wait a minute, Jonas. Oh my God, well, Jonas, I wait for me. Going to just rest against here because I think. I think I mismeasured the magic. Oh my god, Ren's a little crazy! First, there were five. And then, hopefully, Lee, Cla Clarissa dies. And then there'll be four. 10 p.m. Okay, we appear to be in a dark, dark cavern. Join us. Where'd you go, buddy? Ah, uh, great. So we've lost Jonas. And apparently I'm as good as Nathan Drake with my climbing. Look at this. I'm awesome at this. Shuffle, shuffle, shuffle. I really like the art style of this. It's, it's a really sort of... It adds to the mood of the game. That and the creepy music. Sounds like it's out of tune. Kind of creepy, kind of freaking me out, man. Run, 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 jump! Ooh. Oh god. Jonas, are you alright? Shout if you're, like, bleeding or something! Um. Where am I going? Down here? Oh my god. How did Jonas see all this? from just the entrance. That's what I want to know. Is Jonas in on it? Maybe Jonas is really an alien. Maybe he, that's why he brought us here. Hang on, we brought him here. Damn it. My theory doesn't check out. Jonas is still not here. Maybe he drowned in that pool. Why would a guy bring an ashtray down here? Or a pen. Or a pen. Maybe it's from the submarine. Mm, maybe a submarine's down here. Maybe there are Nazis down here. See a man about a dog. Okay. Didn't you hear me calling for you? <laughs> <laughs> Take that, Jonas. Scared you. Oh, I scared you? You scared 
scared me. I had no idea where you were. Yeah. I'm sorry for going ahead. I thought I thought I heard somebody down here, but you know, obviously there isn't. Maybe it's the same person who wrote that on the wall. I mean, I don't even know how this how this happens. It's honestly creeping me out. I feel like we're in Satan's underground lair. <laughs> it's a little creepy, but I mean, it's all just a cave. Just a natural cave. Yeah, you keep telling yourself that. Uh, See? That's what I heard. It sounds like a person almost, right? Doesn't sound Kinda? like a person. I don't know where it's coming from. What could that be? Echoes? Sounds of the ocean bouncing off the walls? Beats me, I failed geology. <laughs> there was a light in here somewhere. Yeah, find us. I want to see what made it. It must just be further in. Let's try and find it before we go back. Can we just go, please? I really don't like it here. Yeah, it's kind of creepy, man. Yeah, okay, we can go. Lead the way. Uh, we're gonna go back this way. <sighs> Thank you. Place is creepy, man. Let's get out of here. Jonas, get your butt back here. Come on. We're leaving. Come on, buddy. Maybe it won't let us leave. How do I get up there? There we go. Climb. Faster. Faster. Before the evil finds us. The evil's coming. It's coming to get us. Oh my god. Run! Well, maybe that's just my imagination. Almost out. Come on. Come on. I'm waiting for the caving to happen. Come on, Jonas. Hurry up. Let's go. Man, you climb slowly. Jump. Here we go. This way. Down we go, down we go. It's probably Cthulhu down here somewhere. We gotta escape. You right there, Jonas, buddy? Jonas is glitched, man. Hurry up, Jonas, let's go! Come on, move, move, move! This, th this can't be the way we came in. Uh, right? It was the way we came we in. Must have doubled back the wrong way somehow, or. Oh my God, this is the way we came in. It is. Alex, yeah, we're stuck. Come on, that's not possible. It's just wall. Uh, where's the crack we crawled through? There's no other. This is it. Oh Jonas. my God, we're trapped. This is the way? If it's not here, then where? We didn't miss it. I don't know where it is. I have no idea. Let's just go back the other way. We got in. There has to be a way out. Uh, this is your... <sighs> no, there really doesn't. We could be stuck in here. It's all your fault, Jonas. You just wanted to come in here and have a look at the monsters. <gasps> now we're trapped here forever. What are we going to do? Ignore that. Uh, uh, uh. Easier said than done. What was that sound? Just don't think about things. What? <sighs> Well, ladies and gentlemen, this is going to be the end of this episode of Oxenfree. It appears that we are now trapped underground with a strange evil sound in the caverns. Will we die? Will Clarissa die before me? Find out next time in the next episode of Oxenfree. Hope you enjoyed the episode. If you did, please smack the like button. Don't forget to subscribe. And I shall see you tomorrow for a brand new episode right here on Captain Dead Meat. Until then, thank you very much. Don't forget to respawn.